In their paper on neuromyelitis optica spectrum disorders, Dr. Bruna Dutra and colleagues from the Santa Casa de Misericordia de Sao Paulo and Fleury Medicina e Saude in Sao Paulo, Brazil, provide a detailed review of these autoimmune demyelinating disorders of the central nervous system. First described in 2004, these disorders are distinct from multiple sclerosis based upon unique clinical, immunopathological, and imaging features. After providing a table that lists the current diagnostic criteria for the diagnosis of neuromyelitis optica, the authors review the pathophysiology of the disorder with a focus on the immunopathology that centers on the aquaporin-4 water channel antigen that is the target of the IgG immunoglobulins responsible for the CNS lesions seen. Particular involvement of the optic nerves, spinal cord, brainstem, diencephalon, and cerebrum is seen. The clinical presentation and distribution of imaging findings of early pediatric onset disease versus late onset disease are discussed, followed by a detailed review of the MR findings in the CNS, particularly the optic nerve and spinal cord lesions encountered. While the incidence of brain lesions is highly variable, the paper illustrates the characteristic but uncommon findings with a focus on patterns of contrast enhancement that should prompt consideration of the diagnosis of neuromyelitis optica. The article then provides an extensive review of the other entities in the differential diagnosis of neuromyelitis optica, including multiple sclerosis, acute disseminated encephalomyelitis, CNS vasculitis, and other less common inflammatory, ischemic, and neoplastic disorders and leukoencephalopathies of the CNS. The paper can be found in the current issue at the following link.